A tour of the Los Angeles hackerspace, Crash Space, on this segment of Hack 5. This segment of Hack 5 is brought to you by GoToAssist. So here we are at Prairie at the uh, <laughs> Hi Darren, welcome to Crash Face. <laughs> Thanks. You're going to be a tour around Crash Absolutely. Face? Absolutely. So uh, we've been around for about two and a half years now. Uh, we're located in Culver City. Um, this is our front room. Uh, we teach all of our main events and our public stuff out here. We also have a little art display up in the front as we show off projects our members have worked on and, and uh, other things that are going on. So the back of the room is uh, set up for our members to work. Oh wow, it's just like a bunch of different rooms and then you assign each room kind of a duty? Each room has a different purpose, so this is sort of electronics. This is uh, several different 3D printers. The Buco bot made by one of our members. Uh, he runs a shop out of Pasadena, a couple rep wraps, electronics test equipment, um, logic programmers, all that kind of stuff is in this shop. As well as sewing, we've had a couple projects going on with that and wearable computing lately. So this is oh, one of the nice <laughs> shop. So this is the one of the primary work areas. Um, behind you, you have our uh, uh, our laser cutter, um, our maker bot, uh, a bunch of electronics gear, uh, drill presses, test equipment, radio gear, all back here. And these work benches get used by our members for all the different projects they're working on. And so what kind of projects do your members work on? So everybody has a different interest. We've got some wearable computing. We've got uh, a bunch of blinking light projects that we've done. We did a mobile rave recently that rolled around on the back of a truck and we could roll it in front of dance floors. Um, we've currently got a bunch of uh, drone projects going on. Um, we've got some classes on, on Amazon services coming up in the near future. So it's whatever our members are really interested in. Would you say it's primarily hardware, software? We, we stick to you know we stick to stuff you can do on a desktop right so we've done everything from electronics design to software projects to uh, you know installations and lights and art projects so we got we've got a good mix. Network room. <laughs> the kitchen slash oh, storage kitchen. slash hazardous chemicals. All oh, the explosives <laughs> in the kitchen. This is our uh, this is our dirty shop. This is where all the machining tools are: mills and lathes and drill presses and and routers. And this is where they're going to make a mess when they carve into metal and wood and, and all the rest of that. And then the back shop, we've got welding gear, we've got band saws, we've got table saws, we've got um, a kiln, right? We've got stock supplies. So we sort of take over the whole space. We've got so much stuff in here, and people pull out the tools as they need them and crank on their projects. So how do people get involved in the, uh, the community here at Crash Space, and how do they find out about it, and you know, what do you guys do as far as community-wise? So the way you really want to get a hold of us is, is start on the member list, right? We have a, a mailing list called CrashSpace.org, and uh, it's a CrashSpace group on Google Groups. And that's a great way to get started because you can just join the group, you can jump in the discussions. Every Tuesday night we have a member meeting, and particularly the second Tuesday of the month is our open public house night. So we can basically show off our, our projects that people have been working on, give tours, and, and get people introduced to the space. And then they're welcome to join and become a member and, and uh, come use the space themselves. So what's the primary reaction when uh, new members or new potential members come to your, uh, your open houses? What do you hear? So everybody likes the projects and they like the demos that we get to show off. The big thing that starts off is sort of, what am I going to do with this? And the answer is whatever you want, right? We really want people to pick up their project and jump in. And we've got such a broad range of expertise and everything from machining to electronics to art. And so when you hit a problem on whatever kind of project you're working on, there is somebody in our group that can help you and can get you past your hump. And as long as you're willing to dive in and start doing something, they'll get you through to the end. I love that about the community. It's really about you know, a, uh, coming together in person if you can and, uh, and just helping one another. And that's what makes it a hacker community. So great. Exactly, exactly. We all share our ideas. And it's a lot of inspiration, right? So-and-so's building a cape right now that he's going to put lights in, and that might spread an idea to somebody else who wants to do their wearable computing project. And that's the way all these things get started. So everybody should go over to where? Crashspace.org? Crashspace.org is our main website. You can look at our event calendar, see what's coming up. If there's something interesting, come on by the space and join our mailing list and jump in and say hi. Thanks for showing us around. Sure. Happy to. In a world of IT, issues can pop up at any moment. Unexpected user problems, network and server complications, viruses, and staying on top of it all, challenging, stressful, yes, to say the least. And that's why I'm excited 
about GoToAssist by Citrix. All of the services you need are integrated into one simple cloud-based tool set so you can take your world under control. GoToAssist monitoring helps you quickly identify potential issues at the source of the problem before they become big problems. Customizable dashboards displaying all the performance of all your service, networks, desktops, and proactive alerts ensure that you're the first to know about any issue that might arise. And with GoToAssist remote support, you can provide unattended and live support to any Mac, PC, or mobile device from anywhere. And you can easily keep track of all of it with the GoToAssist service desk. I highly recommend GoToAssist. It has saved my bacon. Sign up for your special 30-day free trial. Visit GoToAssist.com. Click on the Try It Free button and use the promo code PAC5. That's GoToAssist.com. Promo code PAC5. That about wraps up this episode of Hack 5. But first, we got some announcements, some oh, trip information, yes. maybe? Oh, oh. Do we? Do we? Yes. Wait, we do. Oh, that's right. Because on September 5th, I'll be in Dallas. And September 6th, I'll be in Houston. And then September 7th, I'll be in Austin. All Ooh. of those are in Texas. Look Good old Texas. Texas. Everything's yeah. bigger in Texas. I know. And then Minneapolis on September 19th. Oh. oh. And then DerbyCon on the 28th. <gasps> Yay! How Aww. fantastic is that? I love Derby Con. I just it's remembered, so like just now, right, right as we started recording the C Block, we got a gift from a fan. Oh, we did. I have it right here. Oh, we should, okay. I should well, you go that. ahead and get that. And you guys always remember that you can always email us over at feedback at hack5.org. Let me know what you think of my segment today, and let Darren know what you think about where he's going and what his plans are. Oh And man. what is this? It looks yeah, this delicious. Came in. Are these gigantic here, yinglings? Here's the card. No. Congratulations on eight years. Eight years of amazing success, and here is to many more. Aw, oh, your Discovery and Revision 3 families. Do you need some help? Oh. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Cool. Whoa. Revision 3, thank you. Yeah. You gonna pop it? Do you know I, how to I properly? Know. Well, do wait. you know how to properly do it? What is it? Because I don't know. It looks like champagne. It needs to be popped. I think no it's champagne. Whoa. Whoa. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, it's got like a zipper and everything. Ooh. Wow. Hey, Sarah, Paul, we're having we're having champagne. This is happening champagne! right now. Champagne. Sorry, Paul. That's it. It's like Def Con never ended. Ooh, it's nice and cold. Whoa, this is so cool. I'm very I like excited. it just for the awesome zipper pouch. You want a big shot? Rotate. Rotate and pull it out. Unzip it. Sure. There we go. Ta-da. Woo! There we go. Thank you for grabbing it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so you do know how to properly take it. Great. And of course, he drinks it out of the bottle. Swan chair. Is it good? Oh yeah, it's very good. Oh, it smells good. Am I really doing this? Okay. Oh, come here. Ooh, that is tasty. Wow. That's really good. Really good champagne. <laughs> Shows on oh, off it's a lip. fruit. That's why. This tastes really good hit, with hit, cheese. Hit it, hit it, hit it. Brut. Brut. <laughs> mm -hmm. Do you like it, Paul? Yeah. He Sarah. took a huge swig of that mm. stuff. Come here. Come here. Come here. Happy uh, eight years in that <laughs> <laughs> Yay, Sarah! <laughs> Thank you, Revision 3 and Discovery. <laughs> yes, that's awesome. Wow. That's I so forgot cool. about this. It was in the fridge, and then that's I was like, very oh, we sweet can't finish them. the episode, and I probably should have grabbed some glasses, but whatever. We've had Hacker an style. awesome eight years. Yes, we have. And here's to eight more. I'm done. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> cool. So that would be 16, and then you'd be 85? What? I don't know. <laughs> Excellent. I don't know how you came I can't up with make this them. number. Um, did you tell them about the feedback at Hack5? I, think I you did. did, yes. And also, um, hack5.org slash follow. That's where we have all of our information, all of our links to Twitters and whatnot, all of our uh, social spheres. Mm -hmm. And I think that's about it. We pretty much covered everything, mm. I think. Yeah. Hackshop.com, you can go there and um, support your favorite show. 
Or you can send us champagne. That's pretty cool, too. <laughs> yeah. We should get more champagne. You know? I agree. This should That's be an awesome. everyday occurrence. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Well, with that, I'm Shannon Morris. This is Darren Kitchen. We're reminding you to trust your trust technolist. Trust your technolist. Ha to another eight years. That just wraps up. Just like that. Dude, I just drank champagne out of a bottle. <laughs> yes, you did. Bro. <laughs> They're everywhere. Oh my gosh. <laughs>